So this next poem, this, this, about two years ago, my mother and myself went to Balanus Low on a bit of a, a recce. Um, and Mum grew up in a house on Church Hill in Ballinus Low. Um, we were talking with Oliver about it a little earlier. So I'll read this for my mother, but also for Oliver, if she doesn't mind sharing that. <laughs> Dedication. Church Hill, Ballinus Low. In your wake again, mother, heading down Dunlow Street, chasing another tale. You're an expert guide, though it's 65 years since you last came home here. We've been by the barracks, your father traced in accounts of parades and drills and emergencies. The decades drop away, the bold child reappears as we climb the former Victoria Avenue. I pictured the unruly troop of boys and girls, blonde, blue-eyed, the devil in the detail. That your plain-clothes D.I. father couldn't talk down from trees round Clancarty's monument. At the top of the hill, the Protestant church looks ancient, venerable, though appearances deceive. A fire burnt it out, friend or foe. It would have been just rebuilt when you jostled for views of the gentry en route for service, then raced past the almshouse to the wall just by the door to line up in order of height and await inspection. We arrive. You haven't been inside since 1945, though your dreams have brought you there constantly. An office refit cannot disguise the tall stairs reshape into a slide for nine brothers and sisters. Back bedroom rearranges into dormitory, then sick room. The window deep set at the front with a view to the clock tower. That the views now blocked doesn't seem to bother you. I envy you this, mother. I envy the clear sight, the instant recall, the glimpses of all that prelapsarian joy.